Families and Futures Coalition of Tanzania is a coalition of organizations aimed at providing practical resources to keep families together and to transform the quality of care for vulnerable children and families. My role as a CAPAS Building Partnership Coordinator is to visit the organization to assess the uh, biggest challenges, organize the CAPAS Building training for them, and provide the on-site support and coaching to make sure that these organizations are able to implement the best practice and they are able to prioritize the family-based care. We have been in touch with the Commissioner for the Social Welfare. The Commissioner for the Social Welfare is in charge of all services that they are targeting vulnerable children and families here in Tanzania. So her role is to make sure that uh, every child and every vulnerable children and, and families they get the quality services. As she has a time to join our first coalition opening meeting, and she was really excited on our plans and our vision because she saw the, the good future for the children of Tanzania. And the other pieces, like things like funding, I think we have uh, good partners that we are working with, and we are sure that we can have more funders from all over the world supporting this work here in Tanzania. My name is Kate McAlpine. I'm the founder and CEO of Citizens for Change. I think that the coalition really adds value to, to practitioners and therefore to kids in that they build the toolbox of practitioners to go on that journey towards care reform. The commitment to family care for children is at the heart and at the mission of the coalition. And I think the key challenge in getting a coalition that works is that process of co-creation, but in adding value to the members so that they can do their work better. But there's also a pragmatic recognition that children in the here and now are very vulnerable and alternatives do not exist everywhere that would enable children to be in families. Therefore, building the capacity of actors who want to do the right thing with kids, but don't necessarily have the toolbox to do so, is a sensible starting point. My interest in Citizens for Change really started when I did my PhD, which explored the worldview of Tanzanians who protect children and started with narrative interviews with women like Mama Pendo who had taken kids into their own homes. We believe that there is a critical mass of Tanzanians who are doing the right thing by kids. They're motivated by what we call ujasiri. Ujasiri really um, is, it means courage in Swahili, but it's made up of a belief that children are angels, a hope that children who are helped will pay forward that help to others, and a moral desire to, to behave responsibly. I represent CISEMA. CISEMA is an organization that wants to see uh, children's services serve their needs and interests. The coalition presents an opportunity to join hands in solving a huge problem that you cannot solve as, a, as an individual organization. There are those partners whose primary job is to do the digital component of work, photography, editing, filming, for whatever campaigns, then we can borrow a leaf from them to help us do that for us. And then it becomes a meaningful coalition. But then there's also data management and data management systems that are a key component of our work. We can say that that is also a strength in terms of data management systems, but then maybe another member in a coalition struggles with that, and then we will use our expertise to share the knowledge. So yes, networking, yes, sharing of expertise, yes, uh, sharing of our time in the expertise, but then also sharing resources. But then also the coalition fundraising for a jo joint cause. Yeah, sometimes there is a grant call that by design you do not have the, the resources inside to consume uh, that grant. You can't have the expertise that is expected uh, to write uh, a concept note of that quality for you to be able to qualify for the grant. So, so, so on a professional point of view, that, that is the, those are the reasons why we think it's important to be in a coalition.
in Tanzania, the challenges that residential homes are facing is that we have tons of kids in the residential cares and majority of the residential homes, they don't have a system in place to have an exit plan to unify the kids with their biological families. Because in Families and Futures Coalition, we believe that the best interest of the child is family first model. A child flourishes better when in the environment of their families. The future for coalition is bright, not only on a local level, but on a national scale. We have so far had three invites from the Ministry of Community Development, Special Groups and Women. So there's a big recognition on our efforts and what we stand for, our values and our mission and vision of child welfare. If you want to change or to be a change agent, it has to come from the grassroots level and not from upwards to downwards approach. We did a baseline survey last year in order to collect their views, where they stand, what are their challenges, what to improve and why to improve that area. Basically what coalition is doing, it's their opinions, it's their views, it's their answers to the challenges that they face. So it creates a more sustainable approach because it's more, we're not working in silos, it's more cohesive and it's consistent and it's collaborative and it's participatory. We are, we are going to change the system of Tanzania.